Hello, in this video we have a third example of finding the domain of a function. Now note that in this example we have two situations to consider. We have a square root where we cannot have a negative number inside the root. We can of course have a zero, but we can't have anything below zero. And the denominator is x squared minus 9, and that cannot be equal to 0, because, of course, anything divided by 0 just doesn't work out. So let's first consider the root of x minus 2. Now, we want x minus 2 greater than or equal to 0. Adding 2 to each side gives the answer of x is greater than or equal to 2. Now this ensures that of course anything uh, that we put in is greater than x, equal to, uh, x is greater than or equal to 2 will of course be a positive number uh, including or greater than zero. So that's eradicated the one problem, but we have to make sure that we don't forget about that after we finish looking at the denominator. Now the denominator reads x squared minus nine. Now we consider this equal to zero because we can of course have a negative denominator, but we just can't have the zero. So we need to find the numbers that incur the, uh, the zero and eradicate them from the domain. And solving this gives so we know that we can't include the numbers 3 or minus 3 into our domain although any other number not including these two uh, is perfectly fine. So you can have 2.999 recurring, or you can have minus 2.999 recurring, or minus 3.0001 uh, without having any problems, but you just can't include 3 or minus 3. So if you consider the number line, we have some conditions we have to impose. So what, what conditions have we been given? We've been given x cannot be minus 3 x cannot be 3 and x has to be greater than or equal to 2. Now if x is greater than or equal to 2 then this minus 3 here isn't a problem anymore so we just ignore that. So we're only interested with things greater than or equal to 2. Now if 3 uh, has to be excluded from the domain then we can consider the point at 2 included up until 3 not included and then from above 3 not included up into infinity so we can write our answer as follows Thank you for watching.